Hey guys, Road Warrior back here. I recently won a custom comp that was going for the uh, largemouth buffalo here at the Blue Crab Island. And here's the setup that I used, uh, as well as I want to kind of double this as a guide. And as a cool run, I end up getting four uniques in this thing and then just pretty much destroy the competition. But I'm really good at these. I got good RNG on top of it, duly noted there. But there's the setup that I used. Uh, as well as if you guys didn't have any marks and you didn't know uh, where to find these, there's a couple spawn points that are really active. Uh, that I found a long time ago, but you want to walk over here, come all the way down there, and then there's a mark right off of that little uh, garage boat dock there. Um, I'll show you here in a second. Um, but again, shrimp or technoplankton will work. 2040 shrimp will get you some uh, side damage or collateral damage or blocker fish, so to speak. Both in, depending on where you're fishing, drum, uh, that sort of thing. But uh, as well as bass but if you don't have technoplankton shrimp will work i do like shrimp as well just depends on what spot i'm fishing it at and uh, here's two other marks you'll see i get a unique from here as well this is just the other they only got two spawn points of blue crab so it's just the opposite spawn point the third spot would be coming over here uh, this is probably my favorite spot not this shoal bass spot uh, the spot i just missed right there you'll see a little dock um, that you'll pull up to and you can get off and fish on that but that's my favorite spot to fish for them uh, as well as um, um, there's a spot on YouTube that's pretty famous, I think, is right up this channel. Uh, you come here, and I, you'll see I got my fourth one there, right here in the middle. Uh, but that's where that mark is. Right there is a boat dock, and I'll kind of show you where to go later on the upcoming clip. Now, as far as the actual run here, uh, you can see the. I didn't realize at first it was trophy and unique only. This is just a uh, sponsored competition uh, for bait coins. But nonetheless, I put on a good showing in it. And I just again. I would also say if you're going to fish for these just for fun outside of a competitive thing, uh, definitely you, you don't have to max your, your reel out. I will tell you, if you ever want to have fun uh, and come and fish for these, pound for pound, they're some of the best fighting fish in the game. I would recommend even a bottom sniper, a Brutus. Uh, this cat boxer does just fine, but again, since I'm trying to reel them in as quick as I can, uh, that would be why I was maxing out my tension there. But in the event you want to have fun, uh, you know, this is definitely something I've, I've said this before on my channel a long time ago when I started. It's a great, uh, if you're wanting to get away from the tarpon and the permit, something new to do. This is a great four spot rotation to have fun with as well. And it's generally speaking again, 2-0 to 4-0, uh, shrimp or technoplankton. Technoplankton is probably the number one go-to for everybody, but, uh, nonetheless, I do like fishing for shrimp with them. And this spot in particular, you'll miss on both in here and there, but you won't get bass. Uh, there's a couple other spots you'll get bass and drum, and that's when I might just go straight to technoplankton. But uh, again, if I there wasn't a strong fighting mechanism right now, this would be one heck of a fight. And again, I assure you, if you want a challenge and you want to go uh, test yourself and uh, your, your fish fighting abilities, that sort of thing, and have fun with it, uh, definitely throw on a bottom sniper, even a Brutus, to set your float pretty deep near the bottom. Uh, as I pull in a 59-pound unique, uh, that's my personal best. I think I ended up getting two or three personal bests in this, which was funny. I think they topped out around 60 pounds or somewhere in there. I can't remember. But uh, moving on to the other spawn point here. I get this one in actually fairly quick. Again, that was just off of a 2-0 again. So 2-0, will work. Uh, just kind of proving that too as well. 55-pounder, uh, though, a little undersized, but not bad. Okay, and then I'm moving on over here to the other spot that I showed you how to walk to in the start of the video. Uh, again, you'll see these things. Uh, the trophies are even a heck of a fight, believe it or not. Again, I'm trying to get these in as quick as I can. This was only a 30-minute comp, so I had to uh, go around first. But you can tell I'm getting a commanding lead at this point. And I originally planned on just fishing three spots. I, you know, at one time, I think I had six or seven spots for these, maybe more. I had erased them a long time ago when I was starting competition, so... Uh, but I do know there's a lot of other spots you can catch these. But in the event that you only had one spot to go for, uh, again, these spots are handy right there off the spawn point. If you're looking to farm something even, they're actually pretty fun. As you can see, that was 2,200 XP and some cash. So if you're looking to get away from the tarpon, uh, definitely a great way to do it. Now, just kind of showing you here, um, this is the spot I told you about that people have probably seen on YouTube before. You just kind of want to walk over here, and you can put your rod stand here. Uh, key note in this spot, for sure, do not use shrimp. I used to try to shrimp over in one of those spots before when I used to rotate and farm these things for fun. Uh, do not use shrimp over here. It's not just both in. There's bass galore over here. Do not use shrimp over here, I assure you. you run technoplankton. Um, but you can catch some nice bass over here as well. So to each their own, if you're just farming, I guess it wouldn't really matter. But... Uh, okay, nonetheless, I hook in and looking at, as you can see, the time's ticking down there, pulling in this last beast here. Um, I really hope this helps you guys out here. If anybody look looking for the uh, smallmouth buffalo, 
or the large mouth buffalo rather but uh look at the size of that another nice personal personal best here and it's kind of showing you i hope again this helps you guys out and uh, we'll see you in the next one i did finish first and got me i think 20 or 30 bait coins but uh, nonetheless hopefully this helps you guys out and we will see you again in the next one